up, Fabrication Nation? It's Friday, fool! And you need this tool. Welcome back to another glorious episode of It's Friday, Fool! You need this tool. My name is Kyle Voss, and every Friday, I bring you a tool. A tool that I use here in this shop, or that has been featured on this channel. This week's tool, well, this week's tool, you would probably know what this week's tool is if you follow me on Snapchat. Because about a week ago, when I was up at Jeb's place, he was using this tool on the SRT8 Jeep. This week's tool is the pneumatic riveter. So if you've ever installed a bunch of rivets with one of these doodads, I mean like a bunch of rivets, then you're gonna understand why this tool is a good one. So basically the way this thing works is you just use a standard air line from your air compressor. It's got a trigger on it. You basically just insert your rivet. Just insert the old rivet. Place the rivet in the hole, you squeeze the trigger. It pneumatically squeezes this thing. Depending on the rivet size, most of the time it can do it in one shot. When it breaks off the stem, the stem falls in the back here. Pretty easy cleanup. This bad boy can uh, really save you some time. You know, if you like popping rivets. You know, popping rivets is kind of like popping bottles in the club. Except you're not in the club and the bottles are more like rivets. I purchased this pneumatic riveter at Harbor Freight I've actually found them cheaper on Amazon. As I always do, I'll drop you some links in the description. You can go check them out. The one thing that I would suggest on one of these, which I haven't done yet, just get a swivel for the air hose plug. You don't want the air hose to be hanging out the side. You kind of want that thing to be able to do what it needs to do. Other than that, I think it's a great tool. It can save you a lot of time. And uh, you'll definitely see me putting this thing to use here on this channel. Well, there you go, guys. This week's tool, the Pneumatic Riveter. Go check it out. As always, thank you for joining me. I'm sure I'll see you guys next week. And, uh... It's Friday, fool!